Hey, what is up ladies and gentlemen? This is Johnny and today we're going to be looking at some of the game changes after the update in Pokemon Go Which has changed the balance in the moves. So they changed the attack power on the moves in Pokemon Go And we're gonna be looking at all the new ones that they decided to change it to because some of these changes are kind of effective They made some moves really weaker and they made some stronger as well So there's probably an advantage over it, but as you can see, I'm just going to go ahead and list them all. Um, I would like to give a special thanks to D-Man420. Well, he's from Reddit, of course. This was posted on Reddit by him. And it gave us information on how the moves changes. So thanks to D-Man420 for giving us the move changes that, they, that happened for the attacks in Pokemon Go. So anyways, we're going to go ahead and start off with the list. As you can see, Solar Beam has been increased to 120 damage. It used to be 65 Blizzard has been uh, increased to 100, which it used to be 60. Hyper Beam used to be 70, now it's 120. Fire Blast was 60 damage, now it's 100. Earthquake was a 60 damage, now it's 100, which is good. Uh, Thunder was 65, now it's 100. Stone Edge was 55, now it's 80. Hydro Pump was 60, now it's 90. Mega Horn was 55, and now it's 80. Rock Smash was five and now it's 15 mud slap was six now it's 15 hurricane was 60 now it's 80 moon blast was 60 now it's 85 bug buzz was 50 now it's 75 heat wave was 60 now it's 80 pedal blizzard was 50 now it's 65 bubble was 15 now it's 25 dig was 45 now it's 70 aqua jet was 15 now it's 25 Dragon Pulse was 50, now it's 65. Seed Bomb was 30, now it's 40. Twister was 15, now it's 25. Drill Peck was 30, now it's 40. Draining Kiss was 15, now it's 25. Power Whip was 60, now it's 70. Fire Fang was 7, now it's 10. Ice Shard was 10, now it's 15. Cross Poison was 20, now it's 25. Drill Run was 40, now it's 50. Icy Wind was 15, now it's 25. Cross Chop was 55, now it's 60. X Scissor is 30, now it's 35. Stomp was 25, now it's 30. Dazzling Gleam was 45, now it's 55. Fire Punch was 35, now it's 45. Confusion was 12, now it's 15. Mud Bomb was 25, now it's 30. Sludge Bomb was 50, now it's 55. Night Slash was 25, now it's 30. Thunderbolt was 50, now it's 55. Uh, Psychic was 50, now it's 55. Flamethrower was 50, was 50, now it's 55. Play Rough was 50, now it's 55. Uh, Aerial Ace was 25, now it's 30. Gunk Shock was 60, now it's 65. Ornaminous Wind was 25, now it's 30. Uh, Air Cutter was 25, now it's 30. Water Pulse was 30, now it's 35. Bulldoze was 30, now it's 35. Ancient Power was 30, now it's 35. Flash Cannon was 55, now it's 66. Flame Wheel was 35, now it's 40. Pound was 8, now it's 7. So this is where it starts to decrease, I think, on the attacks, they where they balance it out. Anyways, this charge was 40, now it's 35. Aqua Tail was 50, now it's 45. Bug Bite was 6, now it's 5. Poison Jab was 15, now it's 12. Now Dragon Claw is was 40, now it's 35. Frostbris was uh, 12, now it's 9. Wing Attack was 12, now it's 9. Vine Whip was 10, now it's 7. Man, wing, Vine Whip was actually a pretty strong attack before. I wonder how it's going to work now. Hopefully it's still pretty fast. Um, so they decreased it a lot. Iron Head was 40, now it's 30. Shadow Claw was 16, now it's 11. Metal Claw was 12, now it's 8. Body Slam was 50, now it's 40. Scratch was 10, now it's 6. And Water Gun, Water Gun was extremely overpowered. I really thought Water Gun was one of the strongest attacks on here, but they decided to change it to 6 damage. I want to see how it's going to effectively do damage now. Lick was 10, now it's 5. Mudshot was 12, now it's 6. And Psycho Cut was 15, now it's 7. So anyways, as you can see, some of the moves have been um, definitely improved with more attack power, which which is really well because it's kind of balancing. Some of these moves were already strong in the Pokemon game, so they definitely needed to increase the damage of these moves. Uh, now some of these moves were kind of weak. Uh, they were already kind of weak, but the thing is they had like super amount of damage. They were do like really good damage, even though it was at a, a little low damage, but the speed was super fast and even tells you the the speed uh stuff that the moves were kind of 
so you can see like the DPS has changed as well um, so that's cool so between the tags so it's kind of different how they changed it a little bit uh, but anyways um, I think I'm satisfied with this changes I know that they're trying to balance it out and tweak it out uh, hopefully it's more balanced but at the same time this would only apply to gyms so you kind you're kind of always going to be able to beat a gym once you have a high level Pokemon um, the problem is that they should <laughs> these tweaks are good to have but when the battle system comes in, these are going to play in more because there's going to be more people battling each other and there should be definitely a more balanced game when the new changes come in for that as well. So I like the direction they're headed with tweaking the 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 moves as well. But for, well, right now they're just gyms though. At the same time, people are still going to be able to take out those gyms. Um, but hopefully when battling comes, if they plan on releasing that anytime soon, and this will definitely have like a good effect on the battling because it will be more balanced. Um, so I think the moves are pretty good. Um, if you guys want to, if you guys don't want to listen throughout the whole moves, I will definitely link it in the description so you guys can see it by yourself. I just wanted to read it out loud. Um, but anyways, if you guys want to see the link, it will be in the description. I'll put all the moves. You can go to the website and just check it out yourself as well. And this was after the update. So anyways, thanks for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to give a like and subscribe to my channel and as well as leave a comment in order to let me know your opinions of what you think about the new moves and how they have changed drastically for you in the game. Anyways, thanks for watching this video and have a nice day.